New at five, just a few hours ago, a plane arrived in San Diego carrying a family of Ukrainian refugees. They were severely injured in a missile blast. ABC 10 News reporter Jennifer Kastner shows how a local nonprofit is helping them put their bodies and their lives back together. Landing at the San Diego airport this holiday, a family of injured Ukrainians who are starting their journey to learn to walk again. It really is a special day here, you know, on July 4th, the day that we celebrate our independence, is that we're going to be able to give a mother and a daughter their independence back. Natalia Stepanenko and her daughter Yana were caught in a Russian missile attack on a train station in April. Natalia lost her left leg and 11-year-old Yana lost both. You have a family that has lost multiple family members. Members, their husband, uh, the father, the grandparents from Russian bombing. They're being relocated here for the next several months as they get fitted for prosthetic limbs and undergo extensive rehabilitation. Behind this is San Diego's Right to Walk Foundation, which offers prosthetic care to amputees who are unable to afford it or access it. On a personal note, my son is an amputee, so I've been involved in this world for many years, and I understand how important it is to have a quality prosthetic that can allow you to live the life you want to live. The team met with the family for the first time last week in Poland. They hope their stay here can help them start over. These uh, people that are coming here want to go home one day, and it's going to be our mission is to get them back uh, so they can go back home. Jennifer Kastner, ABC 10 News.